Yo, what's going on, Sexy Seven? Let us go today. We're doing a ranked one v one, and it's try hard Thursday. So let's see what we can cook up. I think I'm gonna start with a Bakasura game, boys. I think Bakasura is good, and I think maxing the two on him is very, very cheeky and underrated. And we're gonna do it today. I'm fighting a Hercules, unlucky, one of the best gods in duel right now, probably the best. He was definitely top five before this patch, and now that it is this patch, he's probably he's probably up there. I mean, let's just let's just call let's call it how I sees it, right? Like he's probably he's probably up there. Uh, all right, let's see. <clears throat> let's go. Let's just go shell, because maybe that will help me live through one of his burst damages. And then one of each ability. Never mind. I cannot. His name is King Lords, but the L is actually an I. You can see that when he paused, which is funny. I always think it's funny when people have I's for L's in their name. Or like, oh, by the way, uh, why you hi YouTube? Hello. Um, I do need to say, there is a fake Sam the Dude running around in casuals being toxic to everybody. I don't play casual game modes. If you think it's me, then go to my profile. Actually type in Sam the Dude. And, um... <clears throat> and you, uh... You can see if it was me by my, my match history. I'm not hiding my profile. And, yeah, I don't really play casual modes, so it probably wasn't me in general, but... There's a fake sim, the dude running around being toxic to everyone. Just know that it is not me. And uh, if he is toxic to you, I wholeheartedly apologize. There's nothing I can really do about it. I just kind of got to wait on high res to, to get enough reports on that Sam dude account to get banned. He's using a fake name. A fake Sam dude name. All right, did you start red? Okay, angry boy. Okay, angry boy. Why are you mad? Nice. I'm maxing my two because I literally only care about eating minions. The regen is nuts. Look at the sustain, dude. Look at the sustain you get from maxing your two. It's crazy. He wants to pull me under tower. I would very much so not like to not go into tower. All right, he's level five. I'm just going to eat this minion here. Yeah, I'm doing... I'm doing great right now. I'm doing fantastic right now, dude. I think maxing the two on Bakasura is... Unironically, the best way to play him. Like, no jokes at all. Actually, just the best way to play him. I don't want him to back right now because I want to be annoying. He can back now. I don't mind. I am 210 gold up. Not too much, but it's still something. Then we'll go Berserker Shield because obviously defense is good. And I'll get all my damage for my three anyways. But right now, uh, Hercules really thrives in the early game. You know, he's going to punish you a lot for being a big damage monger. Hello. All right. I'm okay with this. I can eat a minion, heal for 170 health, and then fight him. Hold on. I'm going to eat another minion just to make sure I don't die here. All right. He's better than I am. That's unfortunate. But 
you know what's not unfortunate? I can eat this. And maybe invade his blue? I don't know. We'll see. Yeah, I should be able to invade the blue. Should be, should be, should be. Come on, hurry it up. No, I definitely cannot invade the blue. Yeah, that's fine. I miss eight on Fort. But overall, it doesn't matter too much. I don't think he's actually going to be able to get much off of this. Hopefully. Want some cooldown, obviously. Now he's going for red buff. Fine by me. I ate the buff, but I didn't get the buff. Okay. Unlucky. It is fine, though. Hello. Alright, that was perfect. That actually could not have gone better for me. I almost died because I messed up my, my alt. But I didn't. It was only almost. And sometimes only almost is all you can take. <laughs> he did go for the dominance power spike, which I completely respect, by the way. I actually think that's a really good play. Not going trans and going dominance. However, I will say not going trans and going dominance actually does lower your overall power for later in the game, which means I'm better off later. And I've stifled his early game aggression with my two. Or maxing my two, I should say. Obviously, like I said, I'm not going to be doing much damage to him, but I don't care that much. Oh, okay. All right, I'll take a free blink. Why not? I vault up soon. I can tank uh, a one here. But you, sir, cannot tank an ultimate. You, sir, cannot take an ult. I knew I could tank your combo. But you did not know if you could take mine. I should be able to get this tower here. And then I'll clear front lines just in case. Clear these. Get a little bit more XP. I'm not actually scared of you, I think. I heal far too much to care. I heal far too much to care. Holy crap, dude. Holy actual crapsual. I'm going to go hasten because I don't need damage. The damage comes from my three. I mean, it's just true damage. I will probably lose the red buff because of my decision here, which is unfortunate. So I'm going to pick up the blue in case I do actually lose the red. Your middle tower is under attack. Yeah, he just held. All right, he's going to have to blink away. Honestly, there's no point in saving my ult. I was going to try to save my ult, but like, what am I actually saving it for? To be honest, I'm saving it so I can do bull demon faster. No, there's no point in that. Let's just do this. Very, very, very good. I feel kind of bad. Because this guy did say it's his his chroma to GM. However, I am undefeated right now. 23 and 0. And number one in the world, by the way. So uh I'll show you guys after this game just so you can see, but yeah. 
Okay. There's the horrific, which means I do not care to fight anymore. And there's the horrific on, which means I'm willing to fight. You simply cannot fight me. And I still have, <coughs> excuse me, my passive because I'm munching minions so fast, which gives me a bunch of attack speed. Uh, but I also have minion debuff in Phoenix, so. Man, Bakasura is so OP. I'm telling you, you max your two, there's nothing anyone can do to you. And I'm not kidding. All right, you're dead here. Oh, my three wore out. Unlucky. My three wore out. It's actually hilarious when you see the damage difference between my one and three. Like between my normal damage and my three. I have 3,000 gold right now, by the way. I am just being increasingly annoying to this man. He actually didn't even clear the last XP camp minion. Because he was so nervous I was going to backdoor. I'm like 90% sure I heard I heard him use his boulder. I don't know on what, but I'm pretty sure I heard him boulder or something. All right, I'm just gonna... Yep, there we go. There we go, and that should be game. Uh, maybe not game. Maybe it is game. Four seconds. Oh, certainly not. Certainly not. Get me out of here. I have 5,000 gold in hand, by the way. Oh my goodness. Almost killed this Titan. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to back. Let's just spend 5k, shall we? Let's go hastened. Let's go upgraded XE. Um, let's go. Tier one Dom. Okay. That is a huge power spike. Jesus Christ. <coughs> All right. My damage without my three is actually still going to hurt him now. Hello. Hello. All right. GG gamer. GG gamer. I'm so sorry that I couldn't give you GM, but I'm going to show you guys why. And then uh, I'll cut to next game. My nose, dude. <laughs> All right, 3,300 MMR. And there you go. I'm 24 and 0, number one in the world, uh, while taking requests. So I was taking a bunch of God requests yesterday, like Achilles. I did some Fenrir, I did Robin, I did Danza, Tear, Cupid, um, Kuzenpo, <laughs> Kamazots, you saw there. Yeah, so I will uh, see you guys in game two. Yo, what's up, boys? Game number two, fighting inbound, playing Mart to Chorus, but I am playing Bastet. And Bastet is very, very good right now because she got... A little bitty change that you might know uh and that change is that her three now does 
th it has three ticks of health, right? Now, it doesn't matter that much against Martichorus, I suppose, because he has tick damage auto attacks, which kind of eliminates the entire purpose of my being, which is unfortunate. But, um, <clears throat> but yeah, so we're going to see how this goes. Bastet is good. Martichorus is very good. I would argue Martichorus is probably a little bit better than Bastet, but, um, I'm pretty confident, I'd say. I think I'm confident. I'm going to go blue buff because I feel like Mana Hunger is almost Bastet's middle name. Let's see. It costs 160 mana to use all three of my abilities. And I have 500. That's three full rotations without including regen. Honestly, that doesn't sound that bad. All right. He is obviously going to outclear me, I think. He did not outclear me. Did he start red? He didn't. Interesting. All right, he got absolutely clobbered. Absolutely clobbered right there. Holy. My assumption is he does not want me to do this. I don't really plan on doing too much here. I just wanted to throw the three at him so that the minions would group up. Nice. Maybe we kill here. I don't actually see how he lives through this, to be honest with you. Yeah. I don't really see how he lives. He went Bracer. That's interesting. That is very interesting. I feel like Bracer is what you go when you have no other real options. But you definitely have some real options for Relics against a Bastet. Like, for certain. Alright. He does have ult. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna play with that. I'm just gonna run. Go get my Transcendence online. Not messing with that. Up some more items, some more pots, and head back out there. I am double buffed up. I do have to jump here so I don't lose a lot of gold to power, though, unfortunately. Might be able to kill him again. I'm willing to give it a shot. Oh, nah. He's playing passive, passive. <laughs> All right, no big deal. Just clear. And I guess I'll go breastplate. I mean, I was going to use my two, but what's the point, right? What is the point in using the two there? Throw that out. Boom. It kills backline. Now let's just slowly knock this guy down a peg. There we go. I do like putting points in my three. I know I shouldn't do that against uh, Martichorus, though. Let's see. He probably got tier one defense. No defense, and I have tier two. Oh, man. He got wards. Interesting. Walked right into it. That's weird. his alt maybe there we go uh he's dead here for sure yeah i mean if he's not dead he's at least losing his blue there's no universe where you get this right yeah thank you for the blue Thank you for the blue. Thank you for the blue. Thank you for the blue. To the wave wall running away because I want to get my blue buff, obviously. I might not be able to get this one, to be honest. I Going for the wave was a bit greedy. But we'll see. Never mind. He didn't even contest.
good. I grouped the wave up while I uh, while I fought him, which is actually extremely good for me. He just used his one, so I don't think he can seal this. Thank you. I should be safe here. I don't think he can kill me. I just want my breastplate online. Not gonna let me back. Okay. Don't mind that at all. Use your one on me. Fine by me. You gotta prove that you're doing something here though, my guy, because right now you're not proving shit. There we go. There we go. I am going to use my horn chart here to group up the minions. Just so I don't die while clearing them. Okay. Now we back. I have a ton of gold. Let's grab this. And then I really would like to go soul leader actually. Because it doesn't look like he's going into any anti heal right now. And Soul Eater gives me some, some, uh, life steal. Or, I'm sorry, some cooldown. That'll clear. I don't know why I keep maxing my one like an idiot. Or my, my three. I'm doing bozo shit right now, man. All right. I mean, if you don't alter your dead here, right? No. Yeah, hundred percent. hundred percent and yeah i don't know we're uh we're pretty hard chilling here i think i don't see much wrong with our current game plan i'm gonna back right here though which is kind of a risky back because i might lose red because of it but it's fine i want to know what his second relic's gonna be he's farming pretty well i'm two kills up and i'm only 700 gold up i mean 700 gold is kind of a lot but still Dude, he plays so risky. He's playing so risky here. All right, good all. Mm, good cancel too, actually. And he's dead. Ow. Um, I don't care too much about taking tower quick. Oh, he's going soul leader too. But you're doing it so much later than me, dude. There's no way that's worth it, right? I feel like going soul leader for him is not worth it at all. I don't know. He got his shell. Good. My second relic can now be a horrific. Or even just a thorns, to be honest with you. That should clear. Right. I am definitely winning these fights. 
And it is, in fact, not close. I will say, he definitely has better anti-heal options. Because of his two. He's backing. I'm just going to do Bull Demon then. He probably has a ward on it, but let's see. Let's just see. He cleared the wave. He did clear the wave. Your middle tower is under attack. I am going to back here, though, because I get my full beat stick for this power spike. And I'm going to go blink here. I was going to go horrific, but I actually think blink might be a little bit better. Blue buff doesn't really do much for me, but I mean, fuck it, I might as well, right? Alright. No idea where he is. Probably, yeah, just proxy clearing. That's fine. I guess he knows he loses his tower regardless, huh? Me and my boy got this. My 16 damage cat. He's still proxying? He just completely gave me it for free? That seems weird. Is all here. Perfect. He actually got his beat stick as well there. I guess all that farm. Oh, unlucky. It did hit me. Don't let that proc or else I die. Good job, Sam. Don't let that proc or else I die. Perfect. Just annoy him while I get red. That kill really doesn't do anything for me, unfortunately. That's kind of unlucky. Unlucky that I can get a kill and it does almost nothing. But we definitely go serrated and then we go crusher. Serrated is just too strong not to go, to be honest with you. I want to stop him from doing his... His blue... Well, almost. Oh my god, that damage. Holy. I'm gonna say there's absolutely no way you want a piece of that damage. There's absolutely no way that after being slapped by that burst, you come back trying to steal the blue. There's just no way. And that's Bull Demon again. Let's just clear this while we can, I guess. And we'll clear this. I hear you. Throw that out there. I know he's there. Somewhere. Oh, there he is. Okay. There he is. I literally don't need my ult for these fights, by the way, because my ult my ult is basically useless. My ult serves to proc his ult. No. 
Ah, oh, the fact that that hit me sucks. Alright. Alright, nothing new happening here. Let's go get my crusher. Wanted to stop my back really bad there. I want to get red buff. I'm not even going to go for blue. He went crusher. I have a full 20% pen over him. Not that the pen matters too much because we don't really have that much defense, but I do have a full 20% over him. Honestly, if he was hiding in this bush right here, that would have been a master play. Like, that, this bush right here would have been OP. And I know you're in one of these bushes. Alright, there's his ult. Which is extremely good for me. Do some Titan damage while I'm here. I'm pretty sure I just win the game here, right? Yeah. GG. GG. Inbounds, Martha Chorus gets taken down. Bastet is very strong, so it makes sense. I mean, let's be honest. Bastet is big strong. So yeah, I'll see you guys in game number three. What's up, boys? I'm back. I'm going to play a little bit of Anubis this time. A little Anubis. Oh, Hera. Oh. Do I like this matchup? I don't think I like this matchup. I don't think I like this matchup. I feel like I alt and he Arguses, and then Argus kills me while I'm alting. Unless maybe I kill Argus while I'm alting, and then I just get healed off of it. Honestly, you know what? I've convinced myself. I like this matchup. Uh. Okay, hear me out. I'm going to go beads. Because with the relic change, <coughs> excuse me, you're allowed to beads while channeling an ability, which means during my one, I am allowed the beads. So I drop the three wrap one. He starts getting out of it by using his two. I beads his two, don't get polymorphed, continue doing damage with my one, he dies. What do you think? Good plan? I agree. Great plan. Perfect. No, literally nobody commented anything, but still. Great plan. Good plan. Great plan. Do this. Pull. And then last auto attack. Let's go clear away, baby. Or his clear is not good. He just cleared blue. Damn. He's gonna just give me red and go for XP camp. That's actually a smart play, believe it or not. I I like that play. It's very respectful. Just understanding, you know what, dude? I know I can't compete with that clear. I'm just gonna go get XP camps. And he has beads as well. Oh, that almost killed him. God, his clear is so good. His clear is so much better than mine. Not his buff clear, but his wave clear. It's so much safer. I'm a little low. I don't, I don't love being this low. I 
I think I still win these fights, to be honest with you. Need minor repairs. If he comes over here. Oh, there's his beads. Perfect. I made him panic. That was the game plan. Freak him out. Oh, he's running. Okay. All right. The beads down, which means next time I ult, he dies. Next time I'll get that plasma cannon. Absolutely you will, Mr. Anubis. I'm hyped about this one, dude. What's your beads? 170 cooldown. It's a long time. All right. Relax, pumpkin. Ow. He does so much more, like, or my, my one does so much more damage than my three right now because I'm maxing it. Like, to put it in perspective, my three ticked him for 47 and it takes four times. My one ticked him for 46 and it takes 12 times. <laughs> That's the difference, man. All right, I want him to back. Perfect. Perfect. He has no beads. He should die here. How did he know? How did he know? I don't know how he knew, but this guy's got some like next level strats. Because he should be dead right now. He should be dead as all hell right now. Damn. He's just solid, man. I don't know what to tell you. Just a solid player. A solid player playing solidly. Unfortunate for me. But god damn it if I don't respect it. Honestly, the games today have been a lot harder than I thought. Like this game and then the second game. The first game wasn't very hard, to be honest. But um, I didn't expect to be running into pros at 10 a.m. Maybe there's like a pro game going on soon and he was getting ready for it. I don't know. I don't know. I miss everything, man. This is why we can't have nice things. Are you uh, you're trying to fight me, huh? Oh, this is not good. Okay. Ow. Jesus Christ. I'm going to go Genji's and then I'll go Hyphens here. Your middle tower is under attack. He's just sending Argus. I could have beads that, but I didn't think that uh, I would live even if I beads it. I guess there's a chance, but only only having one lifesteal item and him having divine means that. I'm pretty sure there's no way I live that. Bro, he plays so safe. It's actually insane how safe he plays. Alright. Got that Chronos pendant. Alright. I got his horn shard there, I think. I don't know why. I think he just panicked a little bit. I think he just panicked a tiny bit. I want his blue buff. Nice. 
not going to pick it up because I'm terrified of being Argus and, and W keyed. <laughs> Happens anyways, I guess. All right. Not bad for me. Not bad for me. I got decent life steal. You can definitely do this red before he comes over here. And uh, his Argus is down. I don't. His beads aren't down. I think he still has beads up. But uh, we got his blue and we lived through the Argus, so I can't really complain about that. I cannot really complain about that. Let's go get. Never mind. I don't have enough money. this come on blue spawn in buddy or watch him shoot his two over the wall and steal that oh my gosh hello you probably do have your argus up don't you oh. looks like he does oh, he's playing like he does or maybe it's just the fact that I haven't hit my power spike and he wants to abuse it. It might be that. Let's just go this though. Um, gives me 20% pen and then I kind of want to go... I kind of want to go Abyssal Stone. I know it sounds stupid. But like lower those cooldowns a little bit. Might be good. But I'll probably just go Rod next item to be honest. I want some I want some cooldown, so maybe Mirrodin. Okay. Almost full killed him. Perfect. That is actually exactly what I wanted, by the way. And you're dead. Oh, beads and ages. Perfect. Let's go, dude. That's really good for me. I used nothing there. I used my horn shard, but I can turn that horn shard into a blink right now. You know? Um, that's so good for me. Holy. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. I don't know what I want second relic to be, though. Aegis isn't really that good. I mean, it, it could be good, I should say. Aegis could be that good. But generally speaking, it's not that good. Hello? Oh. Nice. He, he's playing so scared, I'm actually just going to zone him here. I'm actually just going to zone you. I don't care. Nice, nice, nice. All right, let's go get Mirrodin. I don't know why. I don't know what he's doing. He's so scared. Next time I'll get that plasma cannon. Like, I guess I understand that you have no relics. But you have an Argus. I mean, it's not like you can't fight back. You just got to be smart about it. But the way he's playing isn't smart. It's terrified. The second he sees me, he just runs away. Like, he definitely could fight back, dude. Alright. Let's see if we can get this tower down. Should be able to. We got a full minion wave here. Yeah, we're vibing. Tower down, baby. The 
Maybe do a little bit of tower damage. Some Phoenix damage. Oh, we walked through that. It took so much damage. Keepers. Huh. Wonder if he has a ward here. He just actually started backing. He just actually started backing. He just assumed I would try to predict the wrap and just started backing. Oh, this guy's better than me. It's it's the only logical explanation to what's happening. He's just better than me. Hello. Oh, bees ages. Bees ages. Oh man, my mouse is being really weird. You see it jittering too, right? It's not just a me thing. Like you guys are seeing it. That's weird. More rocket power. All right. Um. Here the Magus. It's not giving you any pen. He has like base. I, I guess it's ten percent, right? But I don't know. Maybe I'm being too critical. I want to go do Bull Demon, but I don't think I can give up Red. If I give up Red, he has a chance to kill me. As is right now, I think he actually can't do damage to me. I don't I don't think with his build he is capable of killing me. Through my lifesteal, that is. He's definitely going to try and Argus this. I would love to not use my alt here. Nice. Okay, ow. Fine. I'll kill your Argus. Alright. I got the Bull Demon. He's gonna push with his minion wave. He might be able to take my tower if he keeps pushing with it, but I'm just gonna take Phoenix. He doesn't have Argus, so I'm completely fine. He can have my tower. I'm cool with that. I'm cool with you taking my tower if you want. Alright. Probably gonna die here, but I'm just gonna do some damage. Yep. Just do some Titan damage. I don't really mind dying, and um, that gives pen, right? Yeah, it does. Why is my my mouse doing that, dude? I don't get it. I don't get it. It's weird. I don't like it. Um, I should just go double defense. I think probably gonna be the best play for me. Like he's not healing at all, so pestilence doesn't seem that great. But whatever, my damage is fine. Again, you can have my tower. I do not care. Your Phoenix was just taken. I am double defense now. I have blink and alt. So I don't actually see how he stops this. And it is try hard Thursday. So I'm just going to blink past him. If he gives me the opportunity. If not, I'll kill him. But Let's heal up off the wave. Okay. A very angry man WKing us right now. 
All right. GG. GG. All right. Good game. Ended up being 2-2. The game didn't really feel like it was 2-2. Because, I mean, I feel like the first kill he had on me was a genuine good kill. And I just misplayed it. The second kill, I literally just sacrificed myself. So, And there were many opportunities where I could have killed him, but I chose to play objective-based instead. All right. GG on game three. I'll see you guys on game four. What up, boys? Last game of the video. And I'm going to do a tier five Fenrir. I know a lot of people don't like tier five Fenrir skin. They think it's kind of bad or, or cringe or whatever, but I don't know. I feel like it's kind of good. All right, Morgan Le Fay. Uh, not a good matchup for Fenrir because he can one my three off of him. And on top of that, he can one my one. Like I'll jump while I'm in the air. He just drops his one at his feet. And then I can't really do anything about it. So it's not a great matchup for me, but I do think that it is maybe going to be okay. Maybe we can make it through this thing alive. Who knows? I'm going to activate my two one more time in base. I wonder if he's going to try to steal my blue. He honestly could steal my blue. Because he does more damage than me. By a mile, realistically. Like by a long shot. At least at level three. All right. I'm gonna auto five times. So I get more damage on my three. All right. I actually out cleared him. That's really surprising. It's, oh, why would you do red? Why would he do red? That's not what mages start. Mages start blue. Everyone knows that. Oh my god, bro. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. This is going to be a really, 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 really hard game. I told you out the gate. It's not a good matchup. I did take two tower shots, but also in my defense. He did a lot more damage to me than I expected. I'm assuming you did your blue after murdering me. You didn't. Weird, but okay. Honestly, that's acceptable. I don't know. Can he kill me here? No, he can't. Perfect. Let's go back. That was slightly greedy by him. Giving me that kill back is actually massive for me because I do have double buff control, which means we're not even right now. I'm actually ahead. Him giving me that kill back puts me ahead. And you have Chronos Pendant. I have no Chronos Pendant, but I do also... I'm going to take a lot of damage here. Oh, never mind. My three actually clears really well. Even though I'm not leveling it. Oh my god, that scared me. Yeah, so that's what I was talking about, by the way. You saw him... Uh, oh, he just horn sharded. Why? 
Oh, I guess red buff is spawning. And he really wants to get pressure to, to take it. The problem is I don't care if you have red buff. I would say I'm doing very, very good right now. I would say I am doing very, very good right now. How about that? Because I honestly expected not only to not get that kill, but to have to give up the red buff. So the fact that I got the red buff is kind of spectacular. And on top of that, I should be able to get my, my blue. Assuming a few things go my way. And they did. Perfect. Now I could die here, so I'm not going to show my face. So he goes to his blue and waits. Perfect. If I showed my face, he might come to tower and like try to beat me up. Which, oh my God. You see, you see what I mean? I showed my face. He was running that way. He was blue. I showed up while he was here and he was like, fuck it. I'm going for the kill. I told you, I told you. I know people too well, dude. I know people too well. I know exactly how they think. We got a full ass Genji's now. Ouch. I'm really scared of your damage output right here. Acceptable to me. Acceptable to me. Um, you have your blue it's on you i guess i'll just go do oh nice get these two perfect my next item should probably be a serrated it should probably just be a serrated Oh, that is not good for you. Okay, his cooldowns are insane, but I don't know. I don't know if I can get a kill under tower. I probably shouldn't even try. Yeah, uh, yeah. I shouldn't even try. Alright, we'll hyper farm that wave and then go get serrated. Here too. Uh, second relic, I really think it's going to have to be a beads. I also think I accidentally sacked red buff. Damn it, dude. I was really trying to get there in time. Oh. He didn't go for it. Why didn't he go for it? Did he not know it spawned? Was he not paying attention? Wow, that is so good for me. Holy... Okay. Nice. Where are you at? I'm just doing your blue. Hello. Oh, 
Oh, there's no way I missed that, right? That's insane. I die here now. Oh, I mean. Oh my god, dude. I am missing these things that I literally should not be missing. Like missing my one twice while it's a stun. I deserve to lose that fight, to be honest. That was pretty pathetic. That was pretty pathetic. I think I'm just going to go straight for Bull Demon here. I mean, I do a lot of damage. Holy shit. Alright. I don't know where he is. Never mind. I know exactly where he is. Perfect. Perfect. Honestly, I don't even think I needed Bull Demon. I think just getting... My serrated edge spike won me this game. Or might not have won me the game yet, but it won me the tower. Which is the first step to getting big dubs. Go get that red buff. Thank you. And then. I want to go I want to go beat stick because I feel like all mages heal so much. Um but he just doesn't have any life steal built in. His healing and his alt which can prove to be problematic, but not by much most of the time at least. I say we just go crusher. I think it's safer. It's just safer to go Crusher. Then let's go Dominance, get some more damage on our auto attacks, and I'll probably... I'm going to go Beads. I'm going to go Beads. I don't know if Beads is actually the, the correct play to win this game. I think maybe a Blink is. But Beads is definitely not bad. Beads is never bad. He was very scared. Holy shit. I will say I probably should have maxed my three. Because a lot of these fights. Wow. At full runes, each strike gains 15% additional power scaling. At, yeah. At, uh. A lot of these fights, he's using my one to peel me off of him. But then my three just kills him. Because he has nothing to peel off anymore. Because he can't two me off. I think I was wrong about this being a matchup in favor of Morgan Le Fay. I think it's easier to play as Fenrir. Actually. So I apologize for the misinfo. I'd like to retract my statement and say I think Fenrir wins this matchup. I mean, realistically, what does he do against that, right? Realistically, what does he do against that? He hit every ability and the poly auto associated with it. And it just didn't matter. 
All right, we get Phoenix. Let's go get Red Buff. He just doesn't have enough damage to do anything to me, I think. All right. I know it's kind of stupid, but I think I'm just going to go Aussie. Get more lifesteal. I also only have 20% cooldown, I've just realized. So let's go Hydras instead. Oh my gosh. Dude, my damage is insane. Holy shit. Look at that. Look at that. What what can he do? What can he do? Actually, what can he do? I missed. I missed. I'm going to keep that blue buff alive so I have something to life steal off. My idea worked perfectly. Unfortunately for him, I do have Aussie and a lot of lifesteal. So it doesn't actually matter that I ran because I still have enough health to do Bull Demon completely. And in fact, actually heal off of Bull Demon, which is just stupid. And then still have enough health and fighting capabilities. Do red buff before coming back and probably winning the game. Yes, I have a lot of gold in hand. Yes, I think it doesn't matter. Though I will say, he is playing the defense of his Titan pretty well. I know it doesn't look like it because his Titan's almost dead, but he is. Genuinely. Oh god. Oh god. That cooldown, dude. That cooldown. Get the Phoenix. Oh, okay, we got the Phoenix anyways. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. That cooldown caught me by surprise though. I got knocked back like two seconds earlier than I thought I was gonna be. <clears throat> Look at the Titan. Look at the Titan fighting the ghosts. <laughs> You see it on the mini map? <laughs> it's aggroing the Titan. That's so funny. Oh, that was a big power spike for me, though. I just have to play it like I have a brain cell. I've just been W keying because I don't really need to think that much, but. Time to play it like I have a brain. Oh, I 
missed my my jump. Missing your jump is so bad, dude. It's so bad. Gonna wait for my two and my Aussie to both proc at the same time here. For maximum life steal. GG, Zach. GG. Well played, dude. Your defense that game was actually really, really good. I, it was also a bit of me like being way too overly aggressive because I thought there was no way I lost. But clearly there was a way I lost. And clearly you played that very, very well. So good job on you. GG. Um, ending this tryhard Thursday. Starting this tryhard Thursday I was 100 MMR above second place. Ending it, I am 3373 three, and second place is 3170. So I'm 203 MMR ahead and I am 27 and 0. So honestly, good stuff. Good stuff. I'm proud of my performance this split so far. Um, I am still taking God requests. So, you know, we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. We'll see if I can get to MMR cap without or while being undefeated or we'll see if the second i lose it doesn't matter anymore because having a, a one here looks gross if you guys enjoyed the video make sure to like comment and subscribe and until next time guys peace